All righty, and we're live. We are here today with Tracy. You want to say hi? Uh, hi. <laughs> How about, uh, what are you going to uh, Do you want to tell us your three favorite things about spring? Uh, flowers, apple showers, and plants and flowers. You have lots of flowers? Uh, yeah. I like flowers. Too. They're pretty cool. I'm going to pull us up, make sure we're actually live on my cell phone. We have had some fears in the past with that one. All right. Can you tell everyone what we're going to be doing today? I will, I will, I'm walking. Working on some pop art. About, uh, <laughs> we're, 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 we're doing pop art. Art, pop, art, pop art. Tracy knows a lot uh, about pop art. Because yeah. his favorite thing to do is draw draw, draw, draw famous people, draw, right? Uh, yeah. You love to draw celebrities? Yes. Who are your favorite celebrities to draw? Uh, huh? Your favorite celebrities to draw? Uh, uh what was that, what's that one? Uh, Gaga Gaga and <laughs> Baby Mo and One Way and, uh, uh, The Beatles and... <laughs> P4 and uh, and uh, Lady Supremes. Yeah. Is there anyone you want to say hi to, Tracy? Uh, yeah. Hi. Uh, hi, buddy. Out there. My mom and dad out there. <laughs> is, that what, is that why? Yeah, you could say you could say hi to your mom and dad. Yes. And then we had a couple of shout outs hi, today guys. as well to give. Yeah. Um, we want to give a big shout out to Kim. It is her birthday today. Hi, Kim. You want to say happy birthday to Kim? Uh, happy, happy birthday, Kim. <laughs> We're going to be having a small party later. We're yes. going to celebrate because we love Kim very much around here. We also want to say a big thank you to all of our sponsors and donors who get to make um, the studio atmosphere possible every single day and every single week. Oh. And I know we had a couple more people that wanted to say hi. Dwayne, you want to come say hi? Come say hi. Dwayne, Dwayne's spot. Dwayne loves to say hi. <laughs> you can come right back here. You gonna say hi to someone? Um, mama, hi, oh, mommy. <laughs> you excited to say hi to your mom? Are you excited for spring, Dwayne? Yeah. Yeah, what's your favorite part about spring? The bar is a pretty spring. Yeah. <laughs> um. Harry, did you want to say hi to anyone? I think your mom's watching. Uh oh. Uh-oh. Yeah, I think your mom is watching. You want to say hi? Hi. <laughs> hi. Oh, you got to bend down so they can see you. See, bend down like that. Say hi. Hi. <laughs> hi. <laughs> hi. 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 Okay, thank you. Thanks, Harry. We are going to get down to it and get started with our pop art. <laughs> All right, let's cut to our creativity cam. All righty. So now here we've got some supplies laid out already. We are going to be focusing on some technique this week. And I will give you a brief history of pop art to get this month started. So here we've got some inks for our um, stamps, which we have three stamps. We've got, uh, can you tell us what these stamps are? Sun, board, square, what? Yeah, we got a sunflower. Um, we've got a hummingbird uh, here. Yeah. And we've got and a sun, square. Sun and wave, so let me double check that this wave, camera is working. Wave, wave. Our creativity camera. Wave. In the meantime, I'll pull us back up so you can see us. <laughs> I. Reconnect our creativity cam real quick. You want to tell us anything else about spring you're excited for, Tracy? Huh? Want to tell us anything else you're excited about for spring? Um, spring showers and find some flowers, right? <laughs> they do. You're right. They do. You right? Yeah. So I'm gonna go ahead and change the settings on here real quick. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. We're nice. having a small. Yeah. I like. That technical issue okay. here, but I'm going to work it out real fast. So, um, see what else we are excited about. Are you excited about Mother's Day? Uh, yeah. Yeah, Mom's Day is going up. 
Yep, if you're still looking for some gifts, we always have some available yes. in our store. Yes. Which um, is currently open. It stays yes. open until 6. Yeah, open. And it, can you tell us what days it's open? Tuesday, Wednesday, and Tuesday, Wednesday, and, open. And Thursday, and Friday, and Saturday? Yes. Yeah. <laughs> All right, I think our camera's going to work now. Let's see. There we go. There we go. So, um, let's see, we've got our hummingbird. We've got a sunflower stamp. Yes. And we have yes. a square. And a square. So these, this is one of the most accessible ways um, that we can do pop art, but that most people can also do pop art because pop art is super fun and everyone can do pop art. So we've got our four colors here. We've got blue, uh, a plum, a red, and a black. All right, I'll just move this one here. All right, Tracy, remember how to use these? Yes. Perfect. So you can pick the stamp that you like. Get closer. Which one do you want to use? This one. All right, now put it in the ink. Pick, pick what color you want to use. This, this one? Yep, now press real hard. Okay, now stamp your paper wherever you'd like. How about, how about like... Oh. Yeah, you might have to press a little bit harder, but it looks great. And we can use the other colors too. Oh. What's, a, what's that one? What one? That's the purple. Why don't you try the red? Ooh. <laughs> I think it looks cute. Maybe we should try the black. What's you can try, do you want to try this one? Yeah. Oh, I can't get it. There you go. There we go. That one. <laughs> so now you can use all four stamps if you want, or all three stamps in all four colors, or you can just keep using the sunflower if you'd like. Okay. We're going to stamp our paper a bunch of times. So I'm going to give you guys some cool stuff about pop art. Ooh, and Kenzie said uh, he likes Elvis, and we do. Tracy, do you like Elvis? Yeah. Yeah, is Elvis your favorite? Yeah. Yeah, if you look at his mask, he's got some uh, cool Elvis on it. I'll show you guys at the end, but he loves it. <laughs> so some fun facts about Ooh. pop art while Tracy is stamping away. So pop art was, um, it still technically is going, I guess, but... The majority of it happened from the 1950s to the 1960s in the U.S. and the U.K. Um, the biggest, I guess, signs to look for when looking at pop art are its recognizable imagery. Um, they you always use influences from like fast media and culture. It always has some really bright colors, um, and they use innovative techniques. Like uh, printmaking was really popular at the time. I know that Warhol used silkscreen printing. And Lichtenstein, Roy Lichtenstein used a lot of um, lithograph, which is where you carve metal or stone to get prints to make art very um, quickly. And uh, one of the things that we're using today is mixed media and collage, which was a huge focus of pop art as well. And most of all, pop art was um, about irony and satire about the mass media and how everything could be art and things were selling like crazy. If you guys remember a lot of the um, Warhol images that were created like the Campbell Soup Can and Marilyn Monroe. Uh, those were a lot of satire about just celebrities and how we see them. So we, like I said, are, today are using the mixed media and collage and next week we're going to be taking a look at some celebrity portraits. So we're really excited about that one. Looking good. Oh, yeah, Tracy likes to layer them. Got some really cool images coming out of this. Go ahead and use some more if you want. Okay. Next week we'll be featuring a couple of artists on here as we do some uh, really cool collage. It's going to be on Thursday at 1 p.m. this month. Taking a look at Warhol and Lichtenstein a little bit more next week. Oh. Maybe even a little bit of Richard Hamilton. But we might save that for the end of this month. One of my favorites.
<laughs> Pretty, I like that. You like it? Yeah, of course I like it. I'm just gonna show Melissa. We have Melissa right over here. Yeah, we gonna put it back on the paper so everyone can see it. Yeah, do you want to use any of the other stamps or you want to keep using the sunflower? How about this one? Yeah, do you want to use the same piece of paper or a different piece of paper? paper. Same paper? Okay. You can use your stamps and stamp it on. Okay. He's chosen the square frame. Ooh, I like that. I want to say hello to all of our viewers out there. Let's see who we have with Darlene and Clara and Tom. Kenzie is always Mary. I'm excited you guys got to join us today. We love to see it. Tracy was very, very excited last week. Uh, we were doing some stuff with Jody Man last week in glass, and Tracy looked over and he said, You know, I'd really like to do that. I said, All right, Tracy. And then here we are. This yeah. week is all about Tracy and his fun pop art creations. Ooh, I like that. That's pretty. And Tracy and I made some mugs last week as well, which we are really excited about. We get to glaze them. He likes to make all sorts of things, but mostly celebrity portraits. What else do you like to make, Tracy? What's that, what's that one? Coffee mugs? Yep, coffee mugs. Yes. So if you'd like a handmade mug by Tracy, feel free to look online at our store or come into the store. They do sell pretty quickly. The last one that he made, I actually bought. So we could hang out together, drink some coffee, Ooh. Tracy and I. <laughs> we can uh, enjoy his wonderful pieces. I love working with Tracy every day that he is here and we like to um, he's a lot of fun he's always bringing a bright smile to the day cool do you want us to use the colored pencils now or do you want to use the other stamp okay so we've got some bright watercolor pencils over here which I'll bring closer into the frame and so how watercolor pencils work, if you are unfamiliar, is that we color using them and then we can add water and they will act as watercolor. So it offers more control and also lots of layering opportunities that you wouldn't get in traditional watercolor. He's going to use these. He's going to use these bright colors for us today to color all of this in and then we are going to activate them using some water. Hi, Karen. <laughs> Make sure you fill in the whole box. Yeah, we gotta get all the white covered up. Yeah. Oh, God. Yeah, you keep coloring. I'm gonna go grab your water, okay? Okay, okay. Oh, God. I got some water here. This 
this one from the water and the paintbrush that we will use to activate our watercolors later. So Tracy's utilizing those bright colors from our mixed media here with the ink stamps oh. and the watercolor pencils. He's doing a great job. And his favorite thing, flowers. Favorite thing about spring. Yeah, it looks good. I like it. You want to come say hi, Melissa? Okay. Yeah, Melissa wants to come say hi while Tracy's coloring. Yeah, so we'll switch back to the face cam. Yeah, we better. Go ahead. Go ahead, say hi. Say hi, Mom. Hi, Melissa. Hi. Is there anyone you want to say hi to? Hi. hi, Mom and Dad. You gotta scoot down just a little bit. We're sitting, uh, so. Say, voila, voila. <laughs> Is are you excited about anything for spring? Yes, I'm excited about the I see lots of tulips. Lots of tulips growing. Yeah, I think my favorite thing about the spring is being able to take my dog outside, what? and I really like um, I have a hammock, so I like to go hammocking in the park. I think it's really beautiful. I love parks and being outside. But we're saying hi to Kimberly and Brian. Do you want to say happy birthday to Kim? Happy birthday, Kim. <laughs> we're going to tell her as many times as possible today because we really appreciate Kim around here. As everyone should. She's great. All right. Is there anyone else you want to say hi to? Um. Oh, that's good. Oh, Tracy, are you ready to paint? Yeah. Alrighty, thanks, Melissa. We're gonna go ahead and switch back to our creati creativity cam so Tracy can keep coloring. Hey, Tracy, do you remember how to do it or do you want me to show you? Sure, yeah, sure, yeah. Sure. Okay. Uh, so we're going to take our paintbrush, it's just a regular watercolor brush, and we are going to dip it in a little tiny bit of water, just a little bit to activate, and then we'll choose the saw right up here. And once we drag our paintbrush through the pencil, it turns into a beautiful watercolor paint, so we'll use that to color oh, in oh. all of our flower. Hi, Mary. Want to say hi, Mary? Yeah. Yeah, is there anyone you want to say hi to? You guys say, say that one. Talking on the phone. Yeah. Everyone here loves Live Art Mini, so we always keep it up every week. And so once you've colored it in, it turns into watercolor. All right, so just use a tiny bit of water, Tracy. Just a little bit. You can wipe off the extra on the rim of the cup. Very good. And then you can choose what to color in. I know Mary behind us, we can show her real quick. She really likes to use watercolors, right? Yeah, you like watercolors. You do watercolor every day. Mm -hmm. You like to do glass too, yeah. Catwoman. Catwoman, you're doing Catwoman today? 
Yeah, and I know you did some flowers um, a couple days ago. Yeah. Awesome. It's, thank you so much for saying hi. Yeah. Get back to Tracy's creativity cam. Karen says, great work, Tracy. I love the colors. Yes. <laughs> Yep, I remember the more you rub it, the more it'll spread around. Yep, it's blending out. Use a little bit. What? Hey, do you want me to show you? <laughs> All right, so if we go in small circles here around where we drew, the pencil will spread around. These look awesome, you see. Like that. Yeah. Okay. Yep. So just go back and forth on these lines, and they'll spread out. Like this. Yep. Oh, like yeah. You're doing great. Yeah. Yep. Remember, you might want to use a little bit less water. So dump the, or you can get rid of the extra by wiping the side on the cup. Okay. Yep. You can do that one. This one? Yeah. Mm -hmm. You don't need more water. I think it's okay. We can just go over here. Oh, that looks good. That looks awesome. Karen loves it. <laughs> Use a little bit more water and go on this side, baby. You're doing great. Yeah, we got a couple minutes. We can finish up this piece. Yeah, you can blend some over here. You like this part? Yeah. This is um, okay, we can keep going, you got a couple more minutes, but then we'll be finished with this piece. This looks great. And so maybe after this we can add some more colors on top and keep blending them out. Okay. You like it? <laughs> well, Tracy's having a great time. You think you're finished with this one or you want to keep working on this? Oh, go get, go get that, um, go get that, uh, go get Stemini. Go get my Stemini out there. You can come and look at my paper. Yeah. <laughs> we can show her in just a minute, okay? I'm going to keep finishing it up and then we'll bring her over. Yeah. Stephanie? Tracy has a request. He'd like you to come over and see his uh, his drawing. Let's check it out. Check it out. What's been working on today? This this part. This pot. It's pop art. That's it. We're using we're doing a mixed media piece. Yeah. Using the ink stamps and watercolor pencil. All right. Using bright colors. And next week, we are going to do some more Pop Art Mini, doing some celebrity portraits. And Stephanie helped me make that example as well, so you guys can get to see that later on today. Okay. Hi, Kathy. <laughs> and Tracy's always very excited to show us his art. Okay. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> Yeah, go ahead. Yeah, he's always eager to learn. And he's always excited to be okay. here, and we are always excited to have him. All right, you want to keep working on this one, or you think you're finished? 
No, it looks great. I like it. Okay. All right, so it's. Oh, okay. Push it right here. And we'll switch back to our face cam. Let this dry for a minute. We can get closer. I like it. I like it. Some close up shots of the texture. It's going to dry and we'll keep adding to it, and maybe someday soon you get to see it in our store. We're going to switch back to the front camera. All right, Tracy. We're just going to say a final thank you to everyone for watching today. Oh, mask up. Oh. You can see his Elvis mask. Oh. Um. <laughs> What are you going to tell? What are you going to do? We're going to say a final thank you to everyone for watching. Uh, buddy, thank you for watching me walk, walk uh, buddy. <laughs> and with that, just remember you can always come into the store or visit our online store. We're going to be having a community class in a couple of weeks. It's going to be ceramics. Oh, you want to say goodbye, Dwayne? Bye-bye, everybody. All right. Bye, everyone. We'll see you next week, Thursday at 1 p.m. Bye. I like that. I like that.